On this estate in Hyde in Greater Manchester, you'll find no sign of the Black Horse, and the listening bank is obviously otherwise engaged. But here you will find plenty of small loan companies and the illegal lenders. But this group is hoping to break the near monopoly of those lenders by creating a credit union or a people's bank. The interest on a £30 loan is £1.92. The interest on a £60 loan is £3.96 and the interest on a £100 loan is £6.56. Well, the... Credit unions are regulated by Parliament in this country. They act as a kind of friendly society. You save money and then borrow based on your success at saving a regular amount. Your past history of credit is irrelevant. They proved successful in the Republic of Ireland and in parts of this region, notably North Liverpool. But why have one on the Hattersley Road estate in Hyde? I've had experience of being a single parent and existing on supplementary benefit. And um, that was sometimes rather harrowing because when you've got a number of small children and you have, you're paid on a Monday and have a whole week to go through, you very often can't do that on such a small amount of money. Were you forced to go to money lenders or...? At one time, yes, I was. This is about the finest opportunity possible for running a real, genuine self-help community business. Um, and it would be a terrible disappointment if it failed. This credit union starts in 1988. It's being backed by local church representatives. It's one community's answer to the problems. That was last year. Since our launch on January the 16th, we have over 200 members who have savings of over £5,000 between them, and we're signing more people up every week. Let's see how a credit union works. Morning's post, and what does it bring? In this case, bills and more bills. Mrs Johnson goes to the post and finds that she's got a gas bill for £80. Well, she might be able to pay it this time, but next time might not be so easy. She also finds a leaflet for Hatter's the Credit Union, telling her about her own local people's bank, run by members of the community of Hattersley. Later that morning she takes a closer look and decides that this could be just the thing for her. She discovers that her local collection point is at St Barnabas Church, but she could also go along to St James's Roman Catholic Church, or the community centre, or one of the local schools, each having a collection point.